Another video for you today. Otra video para ti hoy. Gateway SA1. Is your Gateway laptop not booting up properly? Your screen on your Gateway SA1 went black at startup and a fan is not running but no drive indication light is on. What can a problem be you ask? You unplugged a power cord and took out a battery, held a power button down for 60 seconds then replaced power cable and that computer still will not boot. You can try booting that laptop without a battery. Also, please unplug or take out any unnecessary devices, i.e., for example, USB memory stick, DVD, etc. You can try hooking up an external monitor that, that laptop and powered on to see if it is that screen that went bad. Try taking a hard drive out and then reseating it. You can try blowing out any dust with canned air or air compressor out of a system fan. Another thing you can try is taking out memory and reseating it. If there is more than one memory stick, you can try booting it up with one stick at a time to eliminate potential of a bad memory stick. This gateway additional SA1 memory page shows what screw and cover to remove to get to memory. You can boot it, reboot it, and power it off a couple of times to make sure it is fixed. Test each stick of RAM one at a time. Also, it sounds like you have two dim slots or memory slots. Test each memory slot at a time, one at a time. If both memory sticks work in slot A or DIM1 for example, then it's not bad memory and is a faulty memory slot. If only one stick works in slot A or DIM1, then one of those memory sticks is bad. You want to isolate whether or not you have a bad memory stick or bad memory slot. If you have a bad memory stick, then you will want to buy some kind of memory replacement. If it is a bad memory slot, then you will only be able to use one memory slot. What you could do is buy another single piece of random access memory that is larger, i.e., for example, 2 gig instead of 512 megabytes. We'll check out that page really quick. These tips are not just for this specific laptop. I think pretty much any laptop you can use these tips as a generalization. Gateway SA1 RAM replacement. It has good pictures and again with most laptops as a generalization I think you can use this page and photos. They're taking out a battery, taking a screw out removing that plate and it even shows you how to push against these little prongs and then the memory slides up and then you just pull it out you can always browse to anetcomputers.com for the possible potential tips information and tricks to help you solve your most common computer problem thanks you for listening adios